A heavy blow to the attacking Russian army. Russians were crushed. The general staff of the armed forces of Ukraine has reported that the Russians continue to attempt to occupy the territories of Luhansk and Donetsk oblasts. The enemy continues to focus its main efforts on attempts to capture Luhansk and Donetsk oblasts completely. Over the past day, Ukrainian air defense forces repelled 21 enemy attacks. In total, over the past day, the Russians launched three missile strikes, two of which were delivered from S-300 anti-aircraft missile systems against Kramatorsk and 13 airstrikes. They also fired about 30 times using the multiple launch rocket systems at the positions of our troops and settlements. On the Bakhmut front, the invaders conducted unsuccessful offensive actions west of Kromov. On the Marinka front, Ukrainian defenders repelled 14 Russian attacks in the vicinity of Marinka. At the same time, Horivka and Pobieda in Donetsk Oblast also came under Russian fire. Over the past day, the Ukrainian Air Force carried out four strikes on clusters of Russian military personnel and equipment, as well as three strikes on Russian anti-aircraft missile systems. Ukrainian defenders destroyed three Russian UAVs of various types. Ukraine's rocket forces and artillery struck two command posts, two clusters of Russian military personnel and equipment, two ammunition storage points and another important Russian military facility. Russia's loss of manpower in Ukraine is about 206.6 thousand people. 400 of them were destroyed in the last day. In addition, Russia lost three tanks, seven armored fighting vehicles, 11 artillery systems, as well as nine trucks and two special equipment during the day.